Hey guys, in today's video I'll be collecting some festival prizes for the re-released event Clash of Floats for 2020. I'll be using the boost item Pep Squad Noodles which increased the activation rate for uh, skills by 25%. That will be nice for Suzuka with her recent skill evolution uh, which gives her crit plus at a 30% rate. With that, let's begin. Uh, as much as I'd like to bring Suzuka up first, maybe I should reposition her in front for this first turn. Yeah, I'll do that for the coming grind. But yeah, it's probably better to move this side because I do want to get rid of the Red Drago first for her risky damage dealt. No, uh, Suzuka's restriction with her ability uh, makes it so that she only gets crit after the first unit she hits, which is pretty. It's really strange for. Uh, but it's like. I mean, I guess she, it, theoretically, otherwise she'd be just as strong as Gima if you could activate all your box. But still, uh, even even with that restriction, I think she turned out pretty pretty strong, except for the first unit hit. But yeah, like I said, she she hits just as hard as Gima does on first phase start now. Well, you know, Gima before his uh, break skill evolution. Uh, let's have her own shuffling this way. Osoi, Osoi. Look at that tasty damage. Let's just finish it off like this. Though. So, yeah, Suzuka Russell received a nice skill evolution on top of Taji. Uh, the one skill evolution. The other skill evolutions that came out uh, would be, uh, who are they? Uh, I think, uh, did Tetsuatsu receive one? I can't even remember. But uh, I do know that um, Nobuharu is very interesting one, and it, it was like the least impressive of the bunch. Now, I'll save my thoughts for it later. And surprisingly, Hogan did not receive an evolution at all, which is just like, I mean, I know he's already pretty busted, but like, Yuma was still pretty busted and he received a skill evolution. Like, come on. Turn my bone. Make, make these units more exciting that way. Uh, da -da 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 -da. I kind of want Suzuka on the other side when that happens, so that she can still hit Toji for all her might. Uh, by hitting the the Odi on the left side. So I will have it so that there you go. That should work. Don't you just love when things go perfectly <laughs> from your calculations? Yeah, just like that. Oh yeah, the other unit to receive a skill evolution was Gyoku, which I used in the other drop quest bit, but it's like, it's neat, but it's... Yeah, <laughs> it's neat, that's all I can say, but I'm probably not going to use it that much. Well, I hope you enjoyed the rest of the event. Get to grinding these cute deities. And I will see you guys later. Bye bye.